guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I am doing the what's in my bag video. So jumping straight into things, this is the bag that I am currently using. Hopefully it'll fit in the screen. Um, it was from H&M. I bought it about, about a week ago from H&M and it was $39.95 which is pretty inexpensive for a handbag. I'm not really the type of girl to splurge on handbags. I try to get just good quality, reasonably priced one. So this one's pretty good. I like it. It's um, all black, has gold hardware details and um, it's got like that pebbled faux leather effect which I really like. And it is very compact for me. I know it looks big on the screen but it's actually quite compact but it can fit a lot inside. So, let me show you what's in this bad boy. There we have it. Let's dig in and see what I have inside. I have a lot of rubbish in here, I know that for sure. First thing I pull out are my sunnies. They're just some cheapy ones because I'm pretty sure that if I was to buy expensive sunglasses, they would break or I would lose them. So if I was to lose or break these, I'm not too bothered by it. So those are my current sunnies that I'm using. I have an Inglot bag. It looks quite empty, but there's actually a blush inside. I went to Inglot yesterday with my cousin, and I wanted to pick up a refill of um, one of my orange tone blushes, but I got the wrong color, so I have to return it, which is why I'm keeping it in my bag, so I don't get to do that. My wallet. It is a Mim Curry wallet. I got it from my boyfriend. He bought this for me for my birthday a year ago or something. Um, it's looking a little beat up, though, because just being in my bag and stuff, the hardware tends to scratch, which which sucks, but it's okay, it still looks good, it has the rose gold detail, so inside I have coins that are just falling everywhere, and just a bunch of cards, and a picture of my boyfriend and I, so that's what's in my wallet. Next up I have my car keys, I have a lot of keys actually, the majority of these are keys to the house, my gym tag and uh, car key and then I have the matching keychain to my wallet which I bought because it was an unnecessary purchase but I thought it looked cute so that's my keychain. Next up I have my camera in its pouch luckily because usually I just throw the camera in the bag without putting it in the pouch so they're just flying around in there but this is my vlogging camera so I use the I'm not even 100% sure what model this is. I think it's the... Oh, it says right there. Canon Ixus 125HS. So it's a pretty good, simple to use, compact vlog camera. So I really like to use that. And I usually just keep it in my bag with me, just in case. Next up, I have my makeup bag. It's this bright, hot pink Ted Baker makeup bag. It's so bright, but I thought it was cute, so I bought it for myself. And inside, I don't really keep products to touch up my face because I don't like to touch up my face throughout the day. I just have um, a perfume. This is Versace's Bright Crystal. I love this scent. It's very long-lasting and strong. Um, the lid, I don't know where the lid is because I use per all my perfumes a lot that I misplaced the lid, so I'm not really sure where the lid is. Um, I have a tampon. A bunch of lip products because if I'm going to touch anything up, it's my lipstick or my lip gloss throughout the day. So I have a Maybelline Elixir, Lip Elixir in Nude Illusion, NYX Butter Gloss in Creme Brulee. I have one of my all-time favourite lipsticks. It is the Rimmel London by Kate Moss lipstick in O3. That's all it says, O3. Um, this shade is amazing. It's like the perfect moody pink and then I have a another Maybelline lipstick this is totally toffee number 215 I like this as you can see I like nudes so I have a lot of nudes in my makeup bag and then the last thing I have in here is this hand cream by more the scent is lychee flower and this stuff is amazing I wish you guys could smell this through the camera because it's so good and literally when I wear it people ask me what perfume I'm wearing because that's how strong it is and I have to tell them that it's a hand cream and I let them smell my hands. <laughs> Next up I have some chopsticks because I'm always complaining to my boyfriend that we don't have chopsticks in the house whenever we cook noodles or eat noodles. Um, so when I was in Daiso I was like yep gotta get some chopsticks so they're just some chopsticks. <laughs> 
Next up, I have my one and only Lucas Paul Paul Ointment Greatest Lip Balm Treatment Ever. I have this pen my mom gave to me. It's a breast cancer awareness pen. And it's really cute. Uh, it's just pink with all these little diamond tea type things over it. And yeah, always gotta have a pen on you. In one of the pockets, I have my phone. I can't believe I nearly forgot that. Yeah, I keep it in a separate pocket because one time I threw it in one of my other bags with my keys and it scratched the screen protector. So I really need to change the screen protector but I haven't got around to doing it. Um, but yeah, this is my phone. I have the iPhone 6 Plus in the gold color. Um, and I just have a really thin clear case over the top. Is it like tinted? I feel like it's tinted. I don't need to notice that. Anyway, and in the back I just have um, Skybus tickets from when my boyfriend and I went to Melbourne because I didn't want to lose them and since I never lose my phone, I know that I wasn't going to lose the tickets so I put them in the back of my phone. And um, yeah, that's what phone I use. Next up I have a Mikey from Melbourne. As you can see, I have not cleaned this bag out. I bought the bag in Melbourne and um, I basically transferred all my stuff into it and I have not cleaned it up since the trip so I have this it's pretty much useless to me now unless I was to go back to Melbourne but this is like their public transport um, card where you touch on when you get onto a train or a tram or a bus I'm pretty sure there's money still on this as well so that's just gonna sit there for a while I have this random watch I don't even know what it's doing in here it's a just a rose gold little watch I think I got it from sports girl for like 10 bucks or something I have a plane ticket, another bus ticket, receipts from Target, receipts from Spotlight because I've been buying washi tape. I'm obsessed with washi tape at the moment because I love to decorate my planner. I have a hair tie. I'm always forever losing these. I will buy a pack and lose all of them and I don't know where they go. So I'm glad I found this coins because I'm the type of person who um, pays for things and then I don't want to hold up the line. I just threw some of them on the ground. Anyway, I pay for things and I don't want to hold up the line so I just chuck the money in my bag. So I'll always find like notes and coins in the bottom of my bag. So that's it. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Comment down below and let me know what your number one essential item to keep in your bag is. For me, it's my phone because I feel like I do things where I take my cards and shove it in the back of my phone case, which probably isn't very good for the phone case, but if anything, if I have my phone, I know I have everything with me because I'll just yeah, shove everything in the back of the phone case. So for me, the number one thing that I'd keep with me or in my bag is my phone. So let me know what you would keep with you. I hope you guys enjoyed this video and you're having a really good day. As always, I'll see you all in my next video. Take care.